Hello everyone, it's Infinity here and um, I've replaced some blocks um, of the build. Um, I've replaced dark wood with white wood here and I've put in some clay in instead of normal wood. Also the darker planks, I replaced them with lighter um, planks. Um, I did this because when I put any texture pack I could find on and I saw my build, it was very dark um, looking. It was like a Houghton Mansion or something. Um, so we've put on some more uh, lighter elements in there. And also the glowstone is removed. Because, um, yeah, it didn't look good. Um, in any texture pack I could find actually. Looks a bit weird. Uh, let's go back to fault look. Um, yeah, as you can see it's very very bright right now in a uh, default um, so um, for the default I recommend to keep the um, darker planks in there but um, yeah for other texture packs I found out that it looks better when you um, put some more lighter elements oh I'm lagging a bit so yeah, um, I think this is the best one. Um, Doku Craft Light. I really love this texture pack. I use it a lot. Okay, so right now I'm just gonna make some corners for you guys for your uh, Asian building. Um, <coughs> excuse me. These two are um, with the ones I used uh, in my build here. Um, this slab you can have it or not doesn't matter um, here I don't and there I do I do um, let me just show you real quick how to do it so this is your wall of your house um, hi piggy um, this is the inside so this is all wall 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 and your roof is going around this so what you do is put a plank like that and you put two stairs against that one and also on this side um, here is how your um, how your roof is going against your wall and then you place a block here I use a darker block because I like it um, three slabs on it and your glowstone or whatever you want to have there then remove this one or keep it that's your uh, your opinion what you like about it then place um, one like that and one like that so get um, something like this slap um, there and then your roof continues that way you can also um, keep the slabs coming like that but um, yeah whatever and on this side same I'll just show you show you guys no, like that slap and like that okay there you have it oh almost forgot um, put a block here and there to get a um, cool effect here you may also leave this that's all what you want uh, you can connect these or not also what you want um, so if you're building your house with slabs and normal blocks you'll get this one which is the same but um yeah as you can see they're just slabs here and a block slab there you can remove these and um i prefer to um place them when you're not using stairs make it better but um yep that's it um, this is another one, this is a really small one for a smaller house. Um, it's just your normal blocks here. Uh, slaps, stair, slap, glowstone, slap, stair, uh, yeah, slap. Um, and if you're building a very big temple thing, um, this is the one, this is one of the things you can do. Um, let me just make that one too, I hope we get it right because uh, it's not that easy. 
Let me just check how I started. Okay. So this is um, your wall. This is your roof. Slabs. Um, for very big builds, I um, recommend you use um, slabs and uh, and big blocks instead of stairs because um, you can get a lot of trouble with stairs. Um, also, when you copy paste it, you might um, they might like turn around in the wrong direction. Let's see how many do we got here? Mm -hmm. Yep, we just need another slab layer. Okay, um, let's see. Ooh, hoo -hoo, this is not easy. Um, yeah, yeah. Let me see what I did there. Um, so from no way. Let me just have to check myself. Um, so this is the one. Okay, um, gonna destroy everything. Lies. Easier to uh, put it first in, um, then this block. Two stairs here, like, um, like uh, with a normal building. Then a stair here again two, and then one here also. Move those, but don't remove them. Well, uh, you'll get holes, as you could see. Um, then again, there, there, two against this one, and you get something like this, and then you just keep going. So um, here you put a slab, just down like that, just down like that. Put one here again, two up there, one there again. Always the same, and exactly the same on the other side. There, put one there, one there, one there. Slap on it again. Two here, one here, two here, one here. Um, and yet again, a slap, and then just one. Oh, one. one here, one there, we're almost there guys, slap on there, one against this, one against that, and then you place your close stone and a slap there, to support it, and you might remove this one, keep it, remove this one, Keep it, move this one, or keep it. That's um, what you want to do. You get something like this. Um, I really like this one. And, uh, also, a pinhole you can put upside down stairs to make it thicker. Um, then you should put another material in here. That maybe some more. Um, okay, this might look um, hard, but it but it ain't. Okay, so that's it. That's how to make it. Um, I hope you guys um, can learn uh, out of this. And if you have any questions, just put them in the comments. The other thing I wanted to say is um, the windows. Windows are actually very important when you're building agent stuff. Um, there are lots of different things you can do with them to make them look Asian-y. Like that. Uh, maybe like this. Like this. Or add some here. All depends on uh, how big you need it. You can always leave this open. Um, 
Um, yeah, so yeah, you can you can do with it whatever you want. Just make sure you don't make um, cross like a Christian cross. That's not uh, what they like, I think. Yeah, like I did here. <laughs> um, problem here is that um, it's too open. But um, yeah, let's. I'm gonna keep it like that. Okay. So there's a lot of um, stuff you can do with it. You should. Um, if you're building something Asian, you should um, test uh, with it a bit, like try out some things, maybe just start like this and uh, remove some. This is also a good one, I think. Uh, maybe add here, this is a very big one. For smaller ones, um, that's a harder. Um, don't leave one up there, um, like this. that's weird but when they are connected to something it's better okay um, maybe just leave one open in the middle perfect uh, Asian window hello I'm Asian Ooh, I'm Asian all right so yeah um, what else can I say um, nothing much to say actually I think the roof is the hardest part and it's the most um, it's the most uh, important one oh yeah stuff up here you see it in a lot of um, temples and, and Asian things Asian thingies um, and like Viking they have it too but they have it above their doors I think um, you can experiment with this too as I said in the video I accidentally put one like this instead of uh, upside down but yeah I think it's cool so I left it like that there are a lot of different designs on this also um, um, the white wool wool I wanted to say wool, but I said wood and wool, which is um, good also, because I meant the both. Uh, so the white wool is uh, very good for your buildings in Asian um, style, and also the white wood, because I have like um, paper thing walls inside and stuff. Looks Asian-y. And the wood is also a typical, uh, typical Asian wood, the white one, the burk. So um, yeah, another thing. When I was making the entrance, if you can remember that, um, uh, what I want to say here is just that you don't want to make it like like here, like just flat. You want to do something with it. You want to have things sticking out and stuff. Make, which make it way more oh, like way more interesting um, to look at ah rain I need shelter ah good okay um I'm gonna run for my house because it's raining don't want to get wet go go run ah Phew. Okay, so um, I think that was it for the first part. Um, I'm also making a, um, a second building in Asian style, which is gonna be a tower temple thing. Um, and um, make sure to watch it too if you like this one. And um, subscribe and comment and like. See you guys.